Good morning, everyone. Uh, you're very welcome to this, our first higher education webinar. We will be hosting a number of webinars both today and tomorrow. Uh, can I begin by introducing myself? My name is Brian Doerr and I'm Principal and Chief Executive of the Southern Regional College. I would also like to begin by congratulating all of our learners and all of our attendees at this webinar. Uh, many of you who will have received results today. And I want to pay particular tribute to you for your perseverance and indeed diligence over the last year. It's been a difficult year, but we look forward and look ahead. And uh, today's event, this higher education webinar, is about providing you with information about the options on higher education programs across the campuses that make up the Southern Regional College. I hope following this webinar that you will obtain the necessary information guidance and indeed direction because if we do not answer all of your questions today or indeed provide the information uh, we will be only too happy to do so by way of you making contact with us and you can do that through the college website and i'll refer to that in a few moments the format of the event is that uh, we're going to play a, a video lasting 10 minutes and that video in effect will provide you with the necessary information explaining the range of options available to you at the Southern Regional College, both full time, part time, or indeed through the higher level apprenticeship programmes. And that will be followed by a question and answers. And I would encourage you during the webinar, if you've got any questions to pose, please do so on the chat. Unfortunately, we don't have a live uh, facility where you can come on and ask me directly. So if you could post your questions on the chat facility, either I or my colleagues present will be able to endeavour to answer those questions today. But again, uh, to emphasise that following this webinar, should you want to follow up on uh, any specific course details, the college website is an excellent source of information for you. We also would be only too happy to arrange an interview or an appointment with our careers officers and our HE hotline is again promoted on the website and the number for that is 028 302 59614. So without further ado, I'm going to ask my colleagues now to begin to uh, play the introductory HE video. Thank you. So, you've received your exam results and you're not sure of your next step. We're glad you've joined us today. As at SRC, we offer higher education options for everyone, no matter what results you achieved. You may already have an idea of the type of job that would interest you, or you may not yet have decided. We are confident that at SRC, we have a course that will suit you perfectly. We have six campuses across the southern region, located at Armagh, Bambridge, Kilkeel, Lurgan, Newry and Portadown. Back in September 2020, we opened our two brand new campuses at Armagh and Bambridge. These new campuses have been designed to incorporate industry standard teaching and learning spaces and have state-of-the-art facilities for today's students. Why study with us? 96% of our full-time higher education students achieve their qualification. So that's a good place to start. And our fees are considerably less than the equivalent university course. At university, you can pay up to £9,000 a year in tuition fees. At SRC, we only charge £2,500 a year for a full-time course. And many of our higher education qualifications are validated by Ulster University, Queen's University and other UK unis. Many of our lecturers are experts from a range of industry sectors, including nurses, engineers and scientists. And even though we are a big college, we have small class sizes to make interaction with lecturing staff easy. We also offer our students a wide range of support services to help them through their studies. So where do you start with us? You will likely start with us on a level four or a level five programme. We offer higher national certificates and diplomas, 
foundation degrees and higher level apprenticeships in a range of subject areas. You can also progress in some areas to complete a full degree with SRC. Some of the names of these qualifications might be new to you. So let's take a closer look at what these qualifications actually are. A foundation degree, which is a level five qualification, is a great place to start once you complete your A-levels or level three programme. Foundation degrees have been developed in conjunction with employers, so you will be gaining the skills and knowledge you need to become employable. There is an element of work placement with a foundation degree, helping you get the skills employers want. On completion of a foundation degree, you can progress to year two or three of a relevant honours degree, either with SRC or at a university. At this point, you will have graduated with a level five qualification, so you will alternatively be equipped to seek employment at this stage. We also offer higher national diplomas, which are generally equivalent to two years at university. These courses are vocationally focused, so can lead you straight into your chosen career. They are also a great stepping stone to complete the full honours degree. Higher national certificates are similar qualifications, but are at level four, and they tend to be offered more on a part-time basis. Higher level apprenticeships are a newer qualification introduced about five years ago. They are an alternative route to gaining a higher education qualification and come with many benefits. By studying for your level five qualification, you'll also be employed. Generally, you will spend four days learning on the job with your employer and one day a week in college. The real benefit to these qualifications is that they have absolutely no fees and you will get paid a wage. Many of our higher level apprenticeship students have gone on to complete a top up degree in their subject area while still being employed. Higher level apprenticeships are available in a number of subject areas, such as accounting, science, computing, digital construction, digital marketing, advertising and communications, hospitality and tourism, and mechatronic engineering. Our apprentices are usually placed with well-known local employers. So what subjects can we offer you at Southern Regional College? Within SRC, we have four faculties. The following slides outline the subjects available to you within these faculties. Our Faculty of Health and Science offer various full-time options including health and social care, applied medical sciences, and two higher level apprenticeships in science. The letters and brackets after the subjects shown here indicate which campus the course is offered on. My name is Diane Baxter and I currently coordinate year two of the Foundation Degree in Health and Social Care, which is currently uh, running in Banbridge and Newry campuses of Southern Regional College. Hi, my name is Alex Cassidy. I, like Diane, I'm one of the coordinators for the Foundation Degree in Health and Social Care based in Banbridge and Newry. I'm currently in Banbridge and Newry. We study two days or three days a week in college. So you would be in college two or three days a week and then you would do two days work placement. Often students will come to us they're certain that they do want to pursue a career in health and social care, but they come to us because they're still not quite sure which direction they want to go in. Um, it's not like school, it's different to school. You are encouraged to be more of an independent learner. Um, a lot of students feel that it's a nice bridge between school and university. You do achieve a level five qualification foundation degree at the end of it. So my name is Rhiannon Bland and I'm currently doing a foundation degree in health and social care. Through studying the foundation degree, I believe it's given me many opportunities through the various units that we complete, such as work-based learning and evidence-based practice. So the benefits of studying this course at the SRC rather than university is because the fees are considerably lower at two and a half thousand rather than university. And another benefit is that class uh, sizes are smaller, therefore there's more support and one to one support for all uh, units. So after studying this course, I hope to go on either to occupational therapy or complete the last year of this course in the key. I believe that the Health and Social Care Foundation degree is a great opportunity to improve your skills and gives you a wide range of units that will be um, important for the future.
We have a brand new campus opening uh, in Banbridge for September 2020. So if you want to get your application in, the best way to do this is online. Um, we're looking forward to getting into our new building in Banbridge, a great new study environment. You can find out more details of the new build on the website as well. Um, so we look forward to hearing from you, from you very soon. We also have a range of part-time courses within this faculty, including early childhood studies, counselling and health and social care. My name is Jill. As a higher level apprentice and at SRC, I've since come right through the programme and I now have my bachelor's degree in pharmaceutical sciences through Ulster University and I've recently been promoted within the company to senior analyst. Before joining SRC, I studied my A-levels at Fordown College in Chemistry, Biology and Physics. Uh, I wasn't sure what I wanted to do after A-level, but this option had many different progression routes. The benefit for me has been earn and while I learn. So I was paid a wage to complete my full bachelor's degree. The experience I have gained has also been invaluable. It's allowed me to progress my career and I've been able to move through different departments within the company. From working within the pharmaceutical industry, I've been able to see the many different options available and different avenues that I could take. So I look forward to exploring a few more of those. Uh, there's been no course fees, no student loan debt. It's a debt-free degree that my friends envy. Our Faculty of Computing, Design and Academic Studies covers the subjects of art and design, computing, creative media production, games development and music. Some courses do have specific entry criteria, such as our Foundation Diploma in Art and Design, where an A level or level three qualification in Art and Design is required. For most of our subjects though, you won't need specific level three or A level subjects. Part-time study can suit many students who perhaps want to work and study at the same time or those who want to take their qualification at a slower pace. If part-time study is in your plans, we have a wide range of subject areas on offer, as seen here. Within this faculty, we also offer part-time intensive options in both photography and graphic design. While these are classed as part-time courses, you will complete your qualification in the same time as if you were undertaking a full-time course. Our Faculty of Professional Services covers a wide range of subject areas, including accounting, business, hospitality and travel, tourism management, sport and exercise science, and digital marketing. Again, these courses are offered across a wide range of our campuses. Hello, I'm Zara, and I'm currently studying the Higher Level Apprenticeship in Accountancy. I attend the Southern Regional College here in Newry one day per week, and I'm currently training the remaining four days with SM Vinton Company in Banbridge. The top benefit I believe of doing the apprenticeship as opposed to the typical university route would definitely be the real life experience that you get in the office which wouldn't be gained through the degree route. The other benefit of doing it is um, the fact you earn as you learn. Uh, there's no student debt, no loans to worry about and you're earning a salary. My friends look upon the apprenticeship as a great alternative to university. Whilst they're at university during the week, they're coming home at the weekends having to work to afford the university life, whereas with the apprenticeship you get to earn as you learn, so the weekend is necessarily your own. There are also part-time options available for those interested in business studies, accounting, culinary arts and hairdressing and beauty. The details of all these courses we're showing you today is available both on our website and in our printed prospectus. Our fourth and final faculty is that of building technology and engineering. There are a number of foundation degrees offered on a full-time basis, including construction engineering and mechatronic engineering. We also have very successful higher level apprenticeships in digital construction and mechatronic engineering. My name is Fitton and I am currently in the second year higher level apprenticeship at Mechatronics at Portadown SRC. So I currently work for Sam NI. I work four days a week with them and one day a week at the SRC. The skills that I gain from college, I put them into practice every day in here. For me, the benefits of doing a higher level apprenticeship would be the fact that I don't have any student loans. 
and the fact that I actually earn as I learn. My apprenticeship experience with Sam and I has actually been an excellent one. I've had a lot of opportunity to learn while I'm at work and I've also had opportunities to develop my skills and travel at work actually. I recently went to a tooling conference in uh, England with a few of my colleagues and I learned a lot there. My friends think it's a great opportunity for me and they're a tad bit jealous because uh, I have my weekends free whereas they would have to be working part time. Being on a higher level apprenticeship has given me a debt free degree and two years relevant work experience which is far better than any university can offer. Again, we have a number of part-time higher national certificates in construction and engineering, which are the level four. Most higher education courses within this faculty are based at our Newry or Portadown campus. This is because we have spent a lot of time and money investing in our construction and engineering equipment at these campuses to ensure that our students leave us fluent in the use of modern technology. When you enrol on any foundation degree at SRC, as well as being able to complete your course with considerably less fees, you will also become an associate student of Ulster University. You will be issued with an Ulster University student card, which will allow you to use facilities at any of their campuses, including their libraries and sports centre. Check out the UU website for more details on this. So what qualifications do you need to get onto one of our courses? For entry to foundation degrees, higher national diplomas and higher level apprenticeships, you will need a minimum of a pass in a level three diploma or two A-level passes equating to 48 UCAS points. You can check the UCAS points allocation either by speaking to us directly or by looking through our course prospectus. As we've mentioned, for some subject areas, there are additional enhanced criteria. You can find all these details in our prospectus or on our website. Studying at SRC doesn't start and end in the classroom. We have all the facilities that you would expect to see at a modern college, including extensive learning resource centres, top class fitness suites, hair and beauty salons, canteens and coffee docks, and lots of opportunity to get involved in student life. We have a large number of student services staff who are always available to help our students, be this with student finance, personal well-being, or simply to have fun. College wouldn't be the same without our students union. You can become a member of the student council by standing for office, or perhaps just get involved in the many activities our union organizes throughout the year. These activities are a great way to meet new people and ultimately it's a bit of fun. Our students union gives our students a voice and we are always keen to listen. You have the opportunity to apply right now for courses with places still available. It's really easy to apply. Find the course you want on our website and hit the apply now button. Then just input the required information through each stage of the application process and upload your results. Apply now and you may even receive your offer of a place on a course today. Good luck and please contact us to discuss your options further. I hope you find that uh, short video of interest. Uh, I appreciate that uh, there is a lot to take in in relation to the range of options that the college is able to offer to prospective candidates. Um, but again, I, I would advise anyone to read up on the subjects, the areas that we have available. You can access that through the college website at src.ac.uk. Uh, I note from some of the questions already posted there uh, in relation to applications. Yes, we, we use direct entry applications the college does not use the UCAS system, so direct entry, and that can be uh, obtained through the online application portal that's available through the college website. Should you have any difficulty, again, I refer you to the college hotline at 028 302 59614, and the college staff will be only too happy to guide you through that application process. Um, 
in the uh, the higher education video, there were some important messages there that uh, I want to probably just uh, reiterate a little bit, and that is that the college is at the very heart of our communities. And one of the key advantages of undertaking higher education study, both full time, part time, or indeed through the higher level apprenticeships, is that you work and live locally. And that's one of the key benefits that you would have heard in terms of student debt. You're not going to be lumbered with the level of student debt that would typically be attributed to students undertaking a university type program where fees, as you have seen there in the video, can be up to £9,000. The college has held its fees as low as it possibly can at £2,500 per year for full time study. Uh, the higher level apprenticeship, of course, does not charge any fees. That's an employed programme. And to answer one of the questions that was posted earlier on, can we assist students find employers through the higher level apprenticeships? The answer to that question is absolutely yes. The college has an extensive network of employers that we link with. Uh, we support employers through our business support activities, but we have a, a, an extensive outreach in terms of engagement with local employers we pr who provide placements, but also create those apprenticeship opportunities in higher level apprenticeship areas ranging from sciences to engineering, construction, digital communications, to name but a few. The uh, connections is important as well, because again, the, the benefit of living at home and attending your local college campus uh, has benefits in terms of enabling you, for example, to continue to work part time whilst undertaking study. You don't have the same expenses of living away from home, as I've said. And it's important to also recognise that the range of qualifications that the video covered there uh, include primarily foundation degrees and higher national diplomas through Pearson or BTEC higher national diplomas, as they're commonly referred to. These are qualifications that employers locally uh, seek. We develop these qualifications with industry meeting their needs. So they're developed for industry uh, and that's a key feature of the importance of the, the range of vocational qualifications that we offer both full time and part time. Why are we doing that? Because quite simply, the range of provision that the college offers is meeting local employment needs. That's what we are here to do as a college. And that extensive network with companies ranging from First Derivatives to Almac, Norbrook, Glen Dimplex, to name but a few, those large employers are seeking young people coming through with higher level skills. And if you come through a programme in the college, I can assure you that you will have a great opportunity of gaining employment locally and furthering your career at a local level. As we've seen from some of the higher level apprenticeship students there, Jill, who uh, was employed through Norbrook, got promoted to a senior analyst post. And she is one of many hundreds of examples of students who have come through the doors of the college undertaking higher level programmes and have progressed successfully in their careers. So much so that 97% of those students who come on to a higher education programme at our college uh, will either progress into employment or on to further study. And I would like to mention as well that in the context of the wide range of foundation degrees that we have on offer, they're delivered, as you would have seen there, as a two year full time programme primarily. Those programmes, again, are validated by universities. That's one of the stipulations of a foundation degree. It is a degree in its own right. It's validated. We, we engage extensively with universities, Ulster University, Queen's, Stromilis University College, the Open University. They validate and award these degrees. But equally important is, should you wish at the end of it not to move into employment, but to seek progression to complete an honours degree programme, every single foundation degree programme has an articulation progression route where you can move on and, and indeed progress to completing an honours degree programme with that respective university. And that, in effect, allows you to complete a degree programme in the same time period as you would do if you were to enter a university degree programme from September, typically up to four years. So my message to you is that 
there is a wide range of opportunities available to you locally. And to answer Jordan's question in relation to applications and indeed availability places, there are some places available on our programmes. My message would be please apply immediately because obviously after results day today, many more students will be who did not get places in our local universities uh, will be picking up those places. So the sooner you apply, uh, we will process that application and speak to you directly and hopefully welcome you on to those programmes. So I, I just want to end by uh, again reiterating the point that should we not have addressed any of your queries, please go to the website, please lift the phone and indeed speak to our member of our support team. They'll be only too happy to answer those questions. Uh, the other important feature is that should you have any learning need, again, the college is here to support you. It's one of the key features of our college, as you have heard in the video, we operate in small, cl smaller class groups rather than 100, 150 in a lecture theatre. You'll be operating in group, group sizes of up to 20 in a classroom environment. The level of support that you will receive from our lecturing teams is second to none, but equally, you will receive support through our careers officers, our finance officers who are there to work within our student support team to, to enable you to avail of any financial support that you're entitled to. Equally, our learning support team, should you have a learning need, can assist you in obtaining the necessary resources to support you during your programme of study. So I will end uh, on that point. I hope that that has been of help to you and I sincerely look forward to welcoming you to the Southern Regional College in September. So thank you all very, very much.